So, Collier, you draw your first three character cards and then pass it on. So we are selecting our characters who we are going to be playing for this game of Legends of Draxion. I'm Collier. This game I drew the Sorcerer. I will try and build as many alchemy bolts and shops as I can to generate as much gold to buy as many spells so I can get as many mana pools as possible because that's how the Sorcerer gets his bonus points. It's giving me a clear strategy. I'm going to use those spells to either build extra buildings or fight extra monsters and do whatever generates me the most extra points each turn because I don't need to hold on to them. I'm Jimmy. I'm going to be playing the Barbarian for this Let's Play. Uh, his bonus is what, plus one victory point for every monster killed, so my focus will entirely be on uh, build one or two basic simple combat buildings and then just burn through that monster deck hoping to get as many kills as I can and just rush the game, and that's the basic goal for him. Hi, my name is Tanai, and I will be playing Cleric, and my strategy is to build um, a few basic buildings and, and, and spells and just burn through the cathedral, just try to end the game. Uh, for, for every two cathedrals, I will be drawing an additional one extra resource card. So, if I can get that a head start on that, I can, you know, a runaway train with the resource. So, that's my goal. At the start of the game, everyone draws three resources. So, I'll get you. that taken care of right now. And then we'll let Collier start. Yay! So he draws two resources at the beginning of each turn. Everyone draws two resources. I'm not that special. I will use a stone, a gold, and I will convert this sword and this bow into a food, and I will start the game off with an alchemy bolt. And I will draw two resources, and I'm going to make a big gamble here and buy a spell straight off the gate. Hopefully it's something I need and that I can work with. So, you know what, I'm gonna draw a monster. We'll see. Okay, a itty bitty bat. So I'll just use the wish, wait for two bows. You overkilled that I did, bat. I did. Because bat has three, uh, three hit points and bows deal an additional point of damage. So two bows deal four damage. And that's true of all beasts. Yep. They'll have that beige background. Yep. And the uh, loot for a, uh, for a beast, in this case, the bat, is one resource card, so I draw one resource card. All beasts give resources. Okay. So, Dan, your turn? All right, I'm drawing two. One, two. Let's see what we got here. Alright. Um, I'm gonna use one food, one stone, and I'm gonna buy myself. A farm. All right. I'll draw my two resources. I'll use a gold for my alchemy bolt and a gold for my hand, and I will also buy a spell. I will use wish for a food and a stone, and another gold for my hand, and buy another alchemy bolt. Okay. Make sure that wish goes over there again. I have. Okay. Uh, wait, no, I haven't. Yeah, caught that on you, didn't I? You did. I was trying to sneak it into the regular yeah. resources so I could draw it later. <laughs> and just mess up the game. That's the goal. Exactly. So I'm going to spend a food and a stone, and I shall buy a boyer. A boyer? Yeah, boyer. Oh boy. Exactly. Dan, exactly. your turn. Sorry, I was just drawing two. All right, so let me see. Um, I'm gonna spend, uh, I'm gonna trade, I'll spend one gold and a sword and a bolt to turn this into a gold and I'm gonna buy a spell. I hope I get something cool. Okay, that's fine. I haven't built or fight monster yet, so I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna build. I'm gonna uh, I have one food from the farm, so I'm going to use that. I'm going to use one stone, and I'm going to build myself a quarry. So, your turn. I will draw my two. I will use a food and stone, and a gold, 
from one of my alchemy vaults, and that buys me another alchemy vault. That'll be it for my turn. Draw two. I'll fight a monster. It's a bear. Rawr. Bears have five hit points. Bows deal two, so two, four, five damage to the bear. The bear's loot is draw two resource cards. So I'll draw an additional two, and that's my turn. Draw two. At this point in the game, um, I think Collier is a spell caster of some sort. He's hawking up all the alchemy vaults. So I'm going to try to prevent him from getting too, too far ahead. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to buy one. Um, oh, that's not very nice. Yeah, but you... you maybe, you, maybe I'm not a spellcaster at all and I'm doing this just to throw you off. Just to mess with me? To make you waste a turn, I've wasted three. <laughs> Alright. My turn is done. That's my cunning strategy. Alright. Well, I'm going to use these two alchemy bolts to immediately buy a spell. I'm going to use... And let's gamble. This gold and a gold from my alchemy vault to buy another spell. And that'll be it for my turn. Okay, I draw two. And a monster hunting I go. And a dragon. What a lucky break wow. for me. So, two of dragons have eight hit points. Bows deal two, so two. Can you kill it? Four, oh, easily. Four, six, eight. Oh, wow. That's one dragon down. Loot on a dragon is four resource cards. So one. So you profited two, off of that. Yes, I did. Four. Your turn, deny. Thank you. Two cards. So. All what right. What are you gonna do with your alchemy vault over there, Lord Fancy Pants? <laughs> I'm gonna use it right away. Uh, I'm gonna spend one gold well, plus the alchemy vault. <laughs> I'm gonna buy a spell and hopefully I get something. Yes. So, I'm going to use a Fabricate and a Farm and a Quarry, and I'm going to use a food to get myself a Cathedral. Hmm. And, 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 and Fabricate. Fabricate is um, reduce the construction cost by three building resources. Is that it? Yes. I will draw my two resources, we'll draw a spell, and I have this alchemy vault sitting here. Uh, I'm going to use it for a gold, and use a wish for a food and a stone, and I'm going to build another alchemy vault. Oh man. Uh, am I done yet? Nope. I'm going to use haste, a food. A stone and a gold, and I'm building the last step. Uh, okay, now you're done. Yes. I draw two. I guess that's monster hunting again. That's what I was looking for. An ogre. So he's got five hit points, bows deal one. So one, two, three, four. Five. So that kills the ogre. His loot is draw two additional monsters to fight, which I shall do. And here we have a goblin and a zombie. The gob uh, sorry, yeah, the zombie has three hit points, bows deal zero. If I kill him, I get to draw a spell. The goblin has one hit point. If I kill him, I can discard a resource and draw another monster. So I'm going after that zombie first. So two. Three damage, so two food for a sword, a food and a stone for a sword, and another sword kills the zombie. His loot is draw one spell, and I shall shoot that goblin down with a bow, and 
I will call that my turn. Oh, not gonna discard a resource to yeah. fight that extra monster? Yeah, not with only one spell in hand. Not worth it. Not worth it. Right. Get turn. I'd make a chicken noise at you, but we yeah. have real chickens outside. Indeed. <laughs> Don't want to confuse them. Do not, alright. Um, a nice little pile of monsters. Gonna use two gold. Actually, can use one gold. Alchemy ball. Get myself a free. What are you doing in my spell pile? <laughs> Get out of there, Dan. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna build whatever I think you're going after. <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm, I'm gonna enjoy my thirty points. Jesus Christ! I'm gonna use my farm, <laughs> my quarry, and I'm gonna use the wish to build myself a shop. All right, let's see if two can play at that game. I'm gonna draw two spells since I have four alchemy bolts, and then I'm gonna draw two resources, and. Because I can, I'm gonna fight a monster. It's a wraith. Uh, he has four HP. His loot is to draw two spells. Bows deal zero. You can use a fireball on him. That's three damage. And a sword for the fourth one. He's worth seven victory points, and I will draw my two spells. Are you done? Uh, yeah. I'll I'll call that done. Okay. Draw my two. Fight a monster. Ah, a wraith as well. So, I shall as well use a fireball. And I'll turn these two gold into a sword to kill him. And I'll draw two spells as loot. And that'll be my turn. Draw two. My alchemy ball. That's my one goal. I just I can't have nice things. Alright, I'm going to. Spend one stone and buy myself another shop. Okay, my turn is done. All right. Draw two resources. Draw two spells. And I will fight a monster. I'm going to use Fireball on the Orc to kill him. And I assume you want another monster after? I do. And a goblin. You gonna fireball that goblin too? Uh, no, I'm gonna use a bow on him. Ah. Uh, and I will discard a resource to fight another monster. Okay. Uh, right here. And I have a skeleton. A skeleton. Um, him I'll fireball. Okay. And do you have more resources in hand to discard? I do. I will <coughs> discard a stone. Right here. Actually, I'll discard a sword. Okay. You didn't see that stone. And that will be it for me. Okay. Draw my two. And I'll pick the monster. Figure it's the wimpy little goblin. Take it out with the bow. And that'll be my turn. Oh, wait, no, no, wait. Bow that way. And it'll be my turn. No one need to discard a card, I don't need to. That'd be silly. <clears throat> Going to trade in two balls. Buy myself a spell. Do you want to reshuffle the resources, Jimmy? Yeah, reshuffle those. You have two of any resource and then a farm and a quarry. You could build a shop, you could build more farms. Or... I'm gonna build another shop. Alright. Um, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. I'm going 
gonna build a farm. And I'm gonna use haste. Okay. <coughs> and I'm gonna build a quarry. <coughs> ah. Well, I got a little extra victory points out of that turn. Yep. Alright. I'm gonna draw my two resources. I'm going to draw my two spells. I'm going to use Fabricate and the food to build a shop. Then I'm going to cast Haste and I want to fight a monster. A weekly little skeleton. Perfect. I oh, wish, wish for two swords. And do you have any resources in here? I do. I'm discarding a stone and drawing another spell. And are you done? No. Okay. I'm going to use haste, fabricate, and a stone, and buy another shop. Because Dan apparently wants those, and I'm spiting him now. And that will be my turn. Okay. Draw two... Fighting a monster. There is a dragon. So, two damage with the bow, four damage. Count as a bow for six, and another bow as eight. Wow. He didn't build anything. I have not. And he's, he's doing very well. And one, two, three. Four cards as loot, and I'm gonna play a haste and draw another monster. He might be a druid. Figures, it is an ogre, which I'm not gonna be able to I can kill. Fireball and two bows. But I won't be able to use his loot effectively. However, I will still draw his loot. In case and there's a goblin. In case there's a goblin and I can poke the goblin, so. That is not a goblin. And that is not a goblin. So, unfortunately, the orc and the zombie can, I cannot kill. So they simply are discarded to the side. My turn? Right. Okay. All right. I encourage you to buy all the spells, Dan. He doesn't need all of them. Oh. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna gamble. So you can take a cathedral straight as it is. Yeah, but I'm gonna gamble and use my two shop and then buy a spell. Buy a spell. And yes. two resources, and now I draw three spells with that, that shop for the one extra gold. The monster pile is getting thin, isn't it? Yes, yes it is. I've been burning through it. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten monsters. So, ten out of the twenty-seven monsters are left. I am going to use Fabricate and discard two resources to build another shop. And that will be my turn. Anyway, seems like a little lackluster turn for you, which is fine with me. Oh, it was a productive mm. turn. If you say so. Let's gamble here. Spend two gold, buy a spell. Let's see. That is out of junk 
turn for me. I guess I'll just spend the fabricate and buy myself. That's a very lackluster turn myself. Then I. <laughs> it happens to everyone. Mm -hmm. I hear there's a pill you can take yeah. for it though. Exactly. Make all your turns better. You can slay monsters all night long. I'll keep it PG. <laughs> Alright, uh, I'm gonna s use alchemy vault. Caffeine pills. Indeed. I'm gonna use the shop and I'm gonna buy myself a spell. Alright. Shop, shop, spell. You're really aggressively going after those spells. I'm gonna guess you're a mage of some variety. Going to use a wish by far in my quarry. Yeah, my cathedral? Have okay. it? At all? Although we're going after cathedrals, yep. it could be a rogue or a cleric. So, I have two now. So, next turn. I get to draw another card. I'm drawing my two resources, and now I draw four spells because of all of my shops. And I'm gonna fight a monster. Of course, uh, of course you hit that ogre once you got the fireball. Handful. Two swords, okay. and I will fight the two monsters. No, you don't. Okay, so a bear and a zombie, which unfortunately are nice mid-level ones for him to kill and continue on. Uh, I'm going to fireball the zombie, draw a spell. Um, He's holding nothing but blue cards. Mm-hmm. Because green cards are overrated. I don't like Jimmy's monster pile, and I really want to deprive him of monsters, so I'm not going to fight that bear. I can't actually kill it. But what I can do is haste and fight another monster. Oh. Or just the dragon, which is probably harder for you to kill. <laughs> and I'm not going to fight that. <clears throat> Good. But I'm going to haste and fight another monster. Oh, God. And I am going to wish I had two swords on me to kill that guy. Have any resource cards in hand? I do not, so I ah, can't actually take his life. Nice. Good, good, good. So your turn is over, I assume, without anything yes. else. Yes, okay. it is. How many so monsters do you draw two? Not many. Count. There's gonna be five. One less right here. Alright. Hmm. Got myself an orc, so one, two, three damage kills the orc, and I will draw his loot. For a little bat. And one sword plus these two will count as a bow to deal three damage total. The bat, I take that and I get one resource as loot. Did I? Draw a few cards. Two. Three. Oh boy. Alchemy Vault. Shop. Stone and food with all my farm and quarry. I'm gonna build another cathedral. Yeah, yeah you might be a player. <laughs> um, why not? Let's see, what, let's see what I can do. With enough spells, any cathedral building is possible. Fabricate. Um, any wish, wish. And a food. There you go. Double cathedral across the sky, what does it mean? A holy yeah. man. There's holes like in here? <laughs> like, like going to church. Alright, I'll draw my two resources. I will draw my four spells. Oh, that's... One, two, three, four. Um... 
That's a lot of fabricates. I'm gonna double fabricate and I want a cathedral. Uh, then I'm going to use haste and fight a monster. Wow. A little bit. You know, I wish I had some more bows on me. Oh look, I do. Let me get your loot. Uh, I'm going to. I wish I would prevent discard you from getting all that alchemy bolt. All of this for. Another spell. And that'll be it for me. Drop my two resources. A bear. Three. And I kill the bear. And I get two loot. Do you have any haste? And I do not have any haste, so that is my turn. Alright, I get to draw four now because I have four cathedral. How many do you have there? So, um, three. Three there? So I'm here to four. One more. Thank you. Alright. Um, one goal. Alchemy Bolt. I spell. Um, two shops. Find another spell. Yes. One gold and two randoms by my spell. Okay. Shop, Corian Farm, Stone, my little cathedral. Hold on, I'm not done. Alright, I can do this. Use a haste. Going all out here. Two wish. Two stone. Jesus. And my turn is done. Alright. Two resources. You ready to end Four the game? spells. Oh, we have one monster left? One monster left. But the assumption is he's ending the game here. But he may not. I'm going to use two fabricates to build a cathedral. Now I draw an extra resource. Haha! Which then, you won't get to use. <laughs> then I'm going to use haste. And I will fight the last monster. Triggering the end step. Yep. So this is a raise turn. I'm gonna fireball him and use a sword. And that should get me two spells and seven victory points. Ooh, look, another haste. That's what I was afraid of. <laughs> He's a mage, isn't he? Yeah. Mm, I'm gonna use haste. And. A this might be a close game. We'll, we'll see how many. Fabricate to build a farm. That's it. And that'll be it for me. I was really afraid you were going to have another cathedral bot there. I had a wish in hand, oh, but I was enough. one resource short. The one in my hand is a gold, sadly. So, that's... Not that I have to share that information yeah, exactly. with you, but... Since there's no monsters left, and this is my final turn, let's hope by a spell and pray it is a fabricate. Yeah, it is! Lucked out. So, one fabricate, three food, gets me a cathedral for my last turn, so... Six points out of what I thought was going to be two. Alright, my turn? Yep. Alright, I can draw five now. <laughs> See if you can. Oh, there's one, one or two. Oh, there's only one. Three, so, four, five. Come on. Start counting. Alright. Gold. Three vault. A spell. Nope, that's not what I want. Two shop. That's not what I want. 
what I want. Um, right. One shop for gold. Two randoms. Yes. Um, that's all I can do. So you get the last cathedral and that's it? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Put in stone. Farm quarry. Build the last cathedral. Haste. And fabricate. Build me a farm. That's all I can do. Okay, my turn is done. Okay, and now we are done with the game and we add up points to see who wins. All right. Five, three, six, nine, twelve, plus five is seventeen. Twenty-seven. Plus fourteen, forty-one, forty-six, fifty-three, fifty-six, fifty-eight, sixty, seventy-two, seventy-four, seventy-six, and normally. A mana pool is worth the amount of mana pools you have squared, but because I'm a sorcerer, they're worth an extra three each. So, four of them is 16 points, plus another 12. So, 28 plus 76. Jimmy, you're better at it. 28 <laughs> plus 76. Yeah, 104. 104, and the cards in my hand were oh, worth wow. nothing to me. 124? 104. 104. 104. Wow. Okay. So, I've organized my monsters in groups of 10. Medium difficulty monsters are all worth 5. Hard and easy monsters are worth 7 and 3, respectively. So I can pair them up in 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. And then 67, plus another 6 would uh, make it up to sorry, that, 73. 73, 74, 75. He's worth 13 points, so I am at 88. Three farms, two quarry, 10, 18, uh, plus four, 22, uh, 22, uh, I have six, 7 Cathedral, 6 each, 42, 22, plus 42, 64, and Need for my third, two. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 10 12, 14, 14, 78 total. Alright. There you go. Good game. So, this game I didn't quite win, I was a few points behind. Uh, mostly I didn't quite get through those monsters quite as fast as I was hoping. Uh, if Dan had helped me kill a monster or two, that might have ended the game before Kellier uh, steamrolled through with all of his late game mana based spells. So, unfortunately uh, the game didn't end fast enough for my character to get the victory. In, in the beginning of the game, in, in, in third round, if, if I would have just kind of jump in and and buy more alchemy vault like right off the bat and you know kill some monster I could have prevent Collier from acquiring too many points and and also you know prevent Jimmy from from racking up all the monster I mean with um, I can still buy Cathedral in the end with with, with all the, the spells that I have um, so if, if I if, if, if I would have would have stepped in early on in the game and prevent Collier the game would have been a completely different game, um, so I, I regret not going after him right off the bat. You know, I was being a nice guy. My strategy this game was to build as many alchemy bolts as I could. I was a little hasty on rushing them, and Dan was able to figure out who I was playing. So he built a couple alchemy bolts and deprived me of points. If Jimmy had helped him do that, 
I probably would have lost that game because I wouldn't have had nearly as many spells coming in each turn and therefore would have been a lot less likely to get four mana pools. If I would gotten three, that would have been nine points for the mana pool and nine points from my character instead of the 16 points from the mana pool and 12 points from my character. And that's a pretty big difference. Those points could have went to Jimmy or Dan tipping the scales in their favor. In terms of counter strategy, I tried to go through monsters with pastes or when I fought that ogre and couldn't actually kill any of his loot, I tried to burn through the monster deck quicker to deprive Jimmy of kills. I could tell he was playing some sort of combat based character and so in order to deprive him of points I tried burning through the monster pile. As far as counter strategizing against Dan, I could sit there and use two fabricates in order to build a cathedral and I started to notice later in the game that he was rushing those, so depriving him of each cathedral that I could would cost him more points, or if he was someone like the thief, it would get him less cards in hand each turn.